Unit 15 Cities Reading New York City is located in the southeastern part of New York State. It developed at the point where the Hudson and Passaic Rivers mingle with the waters of the Atlantic Ocean. New York Harbor, which is ice-free in all seasons, is one of the largest and finest in the world. With a population of more than 7 million in the city and 90 million in the whole metropolitan region, and a total area of 946 square kilometers, New York is the largest city in the United States. The city was founded by the Dutch in 1624. At first, it was called Fort Amsterdam, and then New Amsterdam. In 1664, the English took over the city and renamed it New York. New York is a very unusual city. Although it's not the capital of the country, it's the home of the United Nations and the center of global finance, communications and business. New Yorkers are people who come from all over the United States and many different countries in the world. The city is characterized by its hundreds of tall offices and apartment buildings, some of which are among the tallest buildings in the world. Visitors to New York are all attracted by places such as the Statue of Liberty, the Empire State Building, Wall Street and the Broadway Theatre District. New York is also the place where tourists can visit some world-famous art galleries and museums. Unit 15. Listening. The Statue of Liberty, one of America's most familiar images, is on an island in New York Harbor. It's a symbol of freedom. Its formal name is Liberty Enlightening the World. It was a gift to American people from the French to show the friendship between the two nations. This is the statue of a woman who is wearing a loose robe and a crown on her head. Her right hand holds a burning torch, and her left hand holds a tablet with the date July 4, 1776 on it. The statue weighs 205 tons and is 46 meters high. It stands on a stone and concrete base. The base and pedestal increase the height of the monument to 93 meters. The outside is made of copper. Inside, it has an iron frame. The statue was completed in 1884 in France and then transported to America in 1886. Tourists can visit the statue from 9.30 a.m. to 5.00 p.m. daily except Christmas Day. Unit 15. Listening. The Statue of Liberty, one of America's most familiar images, is on an island in New York Harbor. It's a symbol of freedom. Its formal name is Liberty Enlightening the World. It was a gift to American people from the French to show the friendship between the two nations. This is the statue of a woman who is wearing a loose robe and a crown on her head. Her right hand holds a burning torch and her left hand holds a tablet with the date July 4, 1776 on it. The statue weighs 205 tons and is 46 meters high. It stands on a stone and concrete base. The base and pedestal increase the height of the monument to 93 meters. The outside is made of copper. Inside, it has an iron frame. The statue was completed in 1884 in France and then transported to America in 1886. Tourists can visit the statue from 9.30 a.m. to 5.00 p.m. daily except Christmas Day. Unit 15. Pronunciation. Listen and repeat. Th. Think. Thought mouth thin something birthday 
v they those clothes then another brother practice these sentences one I thought mr. Smith was 33 two but next Thursday will be his 30th birthday three something about him makes me think he is like my brother four the roses that you gave him are beautiful five look at the clothes on that thin man over there